hey guys welcome to our youtube channel today i'll be talking about a popular nigerian actress director and businesswoman joker silva mfr joker silva is a graduate of the university of lagos and the weber doggers academy of dramatic art in london joker silva began a career in film in the early 1990s in 1998 he had a major role staring opposite colin Firth and Nia Long in the British-Canadian film The Secret Laughter of Women. In 2006, she won the Best Actress in a leading role at the second African Movie Academy Awards for her performance in Women's Court and Best Actress in Supporting Role at the fourth African Movie Academy Awards in 2008 for a performance as a grandmother in White Waters. Joker Silva is married to Olu Jacobs. The couple founded and operated the Lefodo Group, a media corporation that consists of film distribution assets and the Lefodo Academic of Performing Arts. Joker Silva is director of studies at the latter. Joker Silva is also the pioneer managing director of Malite Films village in association with the Kwara State University. On 29 September 2014, Joker Silva received recognition as a member of the Order of the Federal Republic of Nigeria as one of the national Nigerian National Honors at the International Conference Center in Abuja. Joker Silva is the mother of three Ulusoji Jacobs and Ulubenga Jacobs and Dio Jacobs. Recently, the veteran Hollywood actress has publicly spoken about the state of her husband. As we've all known that Pa Olu Jacob is suffering from a disease. However, rumors was followed that Pa Olu Jacob is dead. But then, Nigerian actress Joke Silva has debunked the false rumors making round that her husband Olu Jacob is dead. Veteran actress Joker Silva has publicly spoken about the state of her husband, Olu Jacobs, health, recalling that there were rumors that he was having an illness. Joker Silva said that Paolo Jacob is suffering from a disease called the mentia with Lewy body. Joker Silva opened up to reveal the, the condition of her husband after Paolo Jacobs was given an award. However, Joker Silva has recounted how she was back blacklisted years ago back in the Nollywood. According to her, she said there was a time that marketers were getting involved in movies and they came to their hours, brought money for her and her husband to come and act a role in a play as the parents of the star of the movie and they decided to do it. Then, then it, they said it was Fred Amata that is directed at that time. She said when they started shooting, things were a bit rocky and they were waiting for the lead actress. They were told to be on location by 8 o'clock and they got location on time. They were never late. Said that they were waiting till 4 in the afternoon, still waiting for the lead actress. And when the marketer that brings the star to the location, she turned around and looked at the director and told the director that she would give extra to this that she knows how location looks like that even after the two days that she is not going to not going to be waiting to work with him again and the director knew that she was serious about it although he never expected that she was going to do that so she after the two days came up um joker silva said she failed up to turn up to the was it called to the event and eventually the movie was produced and then she was black for quite a while of which the movie was produced and as was not mentioned according to her interview with a media personality she said years ago we did this film that was the time the marketers were getting involved in movies this marketer came to our house we were living in ikeja at that time brought money for myself and my husband to come on this movie that they had already started sh shooting and they wanted us to play the parent of the star of the movie and we decided to do it it was fred amata who directed at that time we started shooting and things were a bit rocky until one day we were waiting for the lead actress they told us that we had to be on location by eight in the morning and we got 
on location on time we were never late we got dressed and we were waiting we waited till four in the afternoon when the marketer then bring the star along to the location i turn around and i look at fred fred and said i'm contracted to work with you for two weeks but i'll give you two extra days because i know what location can be like after these those two days if you don't finish i am working fred said i totally understand i'm sure he didn't believe that i'll do that when those two days were up we still had one scene and it was supposed to be a very crucial scene in the film i didn't show up the marketer was big at that time because of that i was secretly blacklisted for quite a while mine was never mentioned but it was done actually the veteran actress recalled how she was blacklisted years ago back in the nollywood but now she's back in the Nollywood working perfectly okay in her acting roles. Hey guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment under the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.